Like it or not, cicada season is in full swing in central Georgia. Selene Arif tagged along with a professor of biology who's studying these critters and taught her a thing or two about what to expect this month. They're all eyes and long legs. And sometimes they'll fly right at you. Cicada season is back. But everybody, everybody at least in the south is going to hear this. Bruce Snyder is studying their effects on local ecosystems. Right, but we're talking about millions of cicadas coming out. Huge amounts of food for all kinds of organisms. We're also trying to figure out which organisms are actually eating the cicadas. He said most other species eat the periodical cicadas. He's studying what the effects could be, but it's difficult because the opportunity comes just every 13 years. Does that actually result in anything in the future or is it just that they have a big meal? Don't know. And that's another thing that's it's very difficult to track those sorts of things. What he does know is that all this sound isn't going away until a few weeks later so when he now. expects most of these cicadas to die. And he says all of that noise that we're hearing, all of that buzzing around town, it really just has one purpose for those cicadas. It's a whole courtship behavior where the male makes a noise and the female clicks her wings and they go back and forth. And that's how they determine, OK, this is a, a, a good mate. He says cicadas aren't very good flyers, so you might see a lot of them on the ground lately. This is also the prime time to see cicada skeletons everywhere since they have to lose that before they mate. And that's why you're left with the, the exuvium and then they they push out their wings and they're adults. And those adults are already hatching eggs, Snyder said. They're very small, so you might not be able to see them, but once they hatch in six weeks, they'll drop back into the ground where they'll stay for the next 13 years. Reporting in Milledgeville, Celine Air, 13 WMAZ News. Now, Snyder told us the cicadas weren't supposed to emerge until this month, but because of warmer conditions, they came out in mid-April. That pushes their life expectancy to the end of this month.